Hi, Max. <laughs> September uh, 5th right now. We haven't uh, taken the camera with us for a while. You can see that uh, in the woods here, it's starting to get a little bit uh, less dense. Nothing's turning color yet, although I do see on my road trips some red trees starting to, to turn over the last week or so. The woods is still pretty. It's just not as thick as it used to be. Fall is coming. She's been wanting to go on this path for over a week. Don't usually take it because there's always a lot of dead fish when you go along the side of the the narrows but uh, today I thought okay I'm gonna let her she stops she always looks up at me as much to say dad can we so today I just said okay so here we have it looks like we've had another big, big dead tree trunk here yep fall down with that wind the other day that we had we can get by it. This is by the uh, tree where we used to get the uh, chicken of the woods. You can see how it's fallen here. There's where it came from. There's the old stump. And uh, you can definitely see how rotted it was here. Not that bad actually, but it, I guess that's punky. Let me just touch it here. Yeah, it's all rot. See that? It's all rot. Ants. Yep. Boy, she sure blew apart. Look how holy that is there from the pileateds working on it. On the... Wow. Yes, sir. Yeah, I think that was the tree that used to get the chicken of the woods on it. Didn't see it this year. Didn't see them this year at all. So... We'll continue on our walk now, coming back to the, the main path. She was looking at this uh, old stump. It was bobbing in the, in the water. She didn't know what it was. Very interested. With all the rain that we've had, the, the water level has gone way up, even in the pond. That is the top of the old log that I used to take pictures of in the summer with two two turtles on it that would go way up in the air and then they'd crawl up on it it's now almost underwater a chipmunk chipped at her so she had to go off and uh, look for it. Well, she's taking me now on the path over toward the log hop cut through to the east field, so I will end up going back that way. Didn't do the pond loop, but we're coming in the other direction, so that's all good. Yeah, there's the log hop that we normally go over. But today she got very interested in something off to the side. So we have to go over there and investigate. Now this is really, okay, I want to see what she does here. And you see how she goes off the path and around and then back to the path. In the spring, there was something on the path right here. I don't know whether it was some scat from something or what. But ever since, she will not cross it. She goes around every single time we take this little path.
Well, the uh, potatoes over here, I think, are getting to the point where they're almost done. Uh, they're still green, though, but he's got some big uh, seed pods on this one. Look at that. Look at those down there. They're supposed to be very poisonous. And there sits the new vehicle with the truck with the new tires too. Very good. I need a black squirrel. It's kind of a rough day out there. It's the uh, Saturday of the Labor Day long weekend, September 5th today. It is rough on the lake, but it's a nice day and I'm not sure how many more nice days they're going to have to get out there. So, more power to them. <laughs> 